Tory. This is the Razorback Nation Pig Trail. We begin tonight with breaking news. We're going to go right to Houston Nutt in a late afternoon press conference in which he announced that freshman Mitch Mustaine will now be the starting quarterback and Robert Johnson is going to change positions. We're going to ask him to go to wide receiver right now. And um, he's accepted that um, with class. And um, we're going to go with Mitch right now, get him ready, and uh, Casey be right there behind him. And then hopefully um, Robert has so much integrity in class, I really think that he'll, he'll have a, a true role uh, at receiver. And I think he can help us. But uh, again, I, it, it's not all his fault. You know, it's just not one person's fault. It's a team game. Um, you just get, sometimes you got to make hard, hard decisions. Hard decisions, and this is this is a hard one. Uh, but um, because because he works so hard, you, you worry about a young man like that because he works so hard. He cares. He's a team player. Done everything we asked him to do. And especially when everything's not his fault, takes 11. But uh, at this particular time, I just feel like we need to make this move. You mentioned it's not all his fault. In elevating Mitch, what, can you talk a little more about the decision making there to do that and, and why? Well, it's just, you know, he, he, Mitch has done some good things all through camp. He's, he's, he's been very accurate, as, as, um, has shown some. Uh, you know some some very good things uh, under pressure, um, and then he gets in the game and you know execute takes us down the field, um, and so just feel like now at this time you just you you, you got to give him um, this shot at this particular time. Was he close enough already that even if he'd had sort of mixed results or, or not mixed, but if he hadn't gotten in the end zone that. You guys still would have elevated him last night, or I don't does know. that one drive really tell you, hey, it's game time yeah. to get it in game yeah. time? Well, it had a lot to do with it. It had a lot to do with it. But um, you know, Robert, I, I know Robert a little bit more. I, I've been around him a little bit more from last year to this year, and there's definitely been improvement. And um, you know, again, if if we're not if we're hitting on all cylinders, we may not be having this conversation, but. You know, for whatever reason, we didn't, and so we we we're just trying to do what's best for our team. You know, and sometimes it involves hurting people's feelings, and that's what's hard. But we we just feel like we had to do what's best for our team. It's it's been close, you know, all the way through camp and all that. But uh, we went with the experienced guy, and I think we did the right thing there. And um, let's just see what happens. I know Robert can still be a very very good teammate and and, a, and play a good role for us. By moving him, you also almost appear to be saying also that Casey's available. I mean, you move him and Mitch gets hurt. Who's the quarterback? So you're, to me, you're saying that Casey can play. Yeah, Casey's well. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is he 100%? I think so. I think so. You seen what, did you guys stay up and kick this around last night as a staff or come in this morning and, and how? Who all was in on the decision? Mm -hmm. Can you take us through that? Alex Wood, um, Gus, myself. We talked about it for a long, long time. I, I Today. just say, yeah, it started this morning, but I thought about it all night last night. I think Robert can make an impact with a receiver. I do, I do. I, I really do. You know, you say, you know, Robert you know, could still contribute. Well, how, how do you see him kind of in the wide receiver mix? I mean, um, on that, on the Damian Williams, Cedric Washington side, uh, with, with three wideouts, four wideouts, two wideouts in that in that rotation. Why, Houston? I'm just curious. Why, why not make Robert uh, a reserve quarterback? Well, quarter. you always have that. I mean, you got you got that option. The thing about it, I, I've been at quarterback before, and uh, this is the second time for him to go through this. Uh, one thing I wanted, I wanted him. To be involved, our, our teammates have a high regard for Robert. His teammates do, and um, the the second team guy is not going to get very much right now, anyway. Okay, mm -hmm. and you sure can't divide up the second team reps between Casey Dick and 
Robert Johnson, uh, where, thing got, where things got all in disarray is when Casey got hurt. See, that kind of threw it out of whack because now Casey finished the year last year. So you've got to go back and give Casey, since now he's healthy, give him a few reps, see if, he, see if he's going to be 100%. Let him try to get ready also. But um, it's hard to have three guys getting reps. You can't do it, especially if you got a freshman that's going to be starting this week. You, you know, he's going to get 85%, 90% of it. Well, it wasn't the start that Arkansas had hoped for, and once again, the opportunity to gain national respect has passed them by. Hogs have